Hello, Tracker1985 here again, and, well, of course, we are here in the Dragovian Sanctuary. We've had a little sleep, and, uh, no, we've had a little save. We've had a little save, and now it's time to see what's gone on in this strange old place. Because everybody seems a bit down. What happened here? Are you... Are you humans? Yes. Well, it doesn't matter. We're dying out anyway. Tell me, what is going on? What in the world happened here? Oh dear. Ah, Master Chen Mui. Everyone loves Master Chen Mui. You have returned to us. You have my sympathies. You've arrived just in time to witness the end of the Dragovian race. The end of the Dragovians? Things are even worse than they appear. We had better visit the other elders. We must get to the bottom of this. Oh, terrible things are afoot. Let's go! Yeah. Need to run faster. Master Chen Nui, what a surprise. It has been many years. When did you return? Save the pleasantries. I returned just you recently. No one's made the uh here. made the conclusion that Chen Mui is Munchie, because Chen Mui is obviously Munchie. <laughs> they even have the same haircut. That's a matter for me to discuss with the council elders. Pray let most honored Chen Mui. You may pass, but I cannot permit the humans to enter the council chamber with What are you gonna do, Chi? Gonna stop us? I don't think so. <laughs> We are facing a dire crisis, and do you stand on formalities? I will take full responsibility for my guests. Now move out of my way at once. <laughs> it appears your mind is made up, Master Chen. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. We in can't let those humans case, in. Let those humans in. Enter. Okay. <laughs> humans entering the chamber of the Council of the Elders? It's unprecedented. I suppose it can't be helped with the things the way they are now. I'm sorry. With things the way they are now. We all have Japanese or chinese accents. What is this? The Council of Elders is in session. Ah! If it isn't Chen Mui! It is! It's actually an arrangement of new indeed. character models. Welcome back to the Council, Chen Mui. Thank you. But let us save the pleasantries for later. First, tell me how the sanctuary could have fallen into this state. Ah, well, you know, yes. you've been gone for I like... That you left before the ritual was how many years? Out. 18 years ago? Very well. And he's just walked Let back in and they don't seem to care at all. He's just sort of... <laughs> I've come back after 18 years! Oh, okay. <laughs> it's like you never left, guy! Just after you left Chen Mui, the Lord of the Dragovians came to a momentous decision. As of course you know, we Dragovians are both human and dragon. He decided the time had come for us to abandon our human forms. What? What? Preposterous! Does such a ritual really exist? I'm afraid Our it does. Our Lord ascended the heavenly dais to test the ritual on himself first. Once it was completed, our Lord became a dragon once and for all. In fact, the ritual failed. As you know, it consumes a great deal of energy for us to remain in our dragon forms. Of course it does. The ritual compensated for this by replenishing the energy from the ambient surroundings. In other words, our Lord began to absorb the energy of his fellow Dragovians. We are slowly being consumed by his unending hunger for energy. Thus, the Sanctuary has fallen into discord and disarray. You know, they could always, um, as as leave. The ritual had failed. 
We appeared before the Lord of the Dragovians to plead with him to reverse it. But the ritual appears to have affected his mind as well. In his current state, he cannot be reasoned with. I'll reason with him with my what fists. What now sits upon the heavenly dais is not the Lord of the Dragovians. David. A savage, uncontrollable monster. He attacked us. We had no choice but to withdraw. Couldn't you all turn into dragons and take him down? He's only one dragon. One dragon versus like eight. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you could do it. And soon the sanctuary of the Dragovians will be no more. I can put it no more plainly. You can always you can always go and make a new sanctuary somewhere else. I'm pretty pretty sure that's not an impossible feat. I see. I see. It appears terrible events have unfolded during my absence. Chen Mui, I meant to ask earlier, but who are your companions? They appear to be humans, if my eyes do not deceive me. I mean no rebuke, I am simply curious. Your eyes do not deceive you. These humans intend to confront the Lord of Darkness, Rapthorn. <laughs> Damn right, Gov. <laughs> the youngest grin. Indeed. Is he? Is he? There will be time for that later. The plan if that is the case, they have arrived at a most fortuitous point in our conversation. But can we really entrust such an important task to outsiders? Outsiders? <laughs> Perhaps you should introduce yourselves to the Council of Elders. Hmm. No matter how I look at it, oh, no matter how I look at it, it is only natural for us to Dragovians to exist in both human and dragon form. Our Lord's decision to abandon his human form against all reason is the root of the tragedy that has befallen us. My accent's not as good. Oh, you're Tracker, are you? My, haven't you grown into a fine young man? What? I don't have, what? Eh? Eh? There is a way to save the Lord of Dragovians from this madness. That is by defeating him in battle. When he falls, he will return to his human form and to his senses, one would hope. As such, we are convened a discussion to select a brave warrior from our race to fight the Lord of the Dragovians in single combat. However, we reach the inevitable conclusion in our present state that there is none of us among that could survive such a confrontation. Hmm. Yes, choose to face that rap thought because we're amazing, we're awesome, we're incredible. Let's see. It will take powerful warriors indeed to overcome the strength of the Lord of the Dragovians. Which makes these humans perfect for the task. Indeed, their valor has been acknowledged by none less than the godbird Imperia. Emmy, don't you mean Ramia? <laughs> We know her real name now. We've Imperia. been to the future and back. I hesitate to ask any more of you when you already journey under such a terrible burden. But before you confront Rapthorn, I would ask that you face the Lord of the Dragovians. Think of it as a personal request from me. Yeah, sure. I had faith in you from the very start. Simply hearing that lifts my spirits immensely. Oh, I think I'm going to have a proper bowel movement for the first time in years. <laughs> Please, come to my home, where I will prepare a cheese banquet suitable for great heroes such as yourselves. Because mm, we all know that well-documented fact that dragons love cheese. I'm sorry, I've got a cat running around. She's gone completely nutter butter. Haven't you, Phoebes? Jeez. <laughs> hmm. 
Master Chen Mui. You finally return. I have looked forward to this day. <laughs> ah, yes. Thank you for watching over things in my absence. 18 years! <laughs> I brought some human guests with me today. I want you to make sure they are comfortable. Guests from the human world? Do you mean one of them is Miss Chia's? Uh, why don't you begin? Miss Chia's what? Tonight's meal? One of us is Miss Chia's what? Uh, of course, Master. A cheese banquet, I presume. I'll begin preparations right away. Please, make yourselves at home. What a spread, eh? I don't think I've ever eaten that much cheese in my whole life. <laughs> Not that I'm complaining, mind. That was good grub. I'm just feeling a bit cosy around the old midriff. <laughs> <laughs> That's Yangus, always thinking with his stomach. By the way, there's something about this Chen Mui fellow that sticks in my mind. Jessica, like, look at Jessica's animation. She kind of looks like she's got hiccups or something. She's like, <coughs> too much cheese. <coughs> we only just met him today. That's better. How does he know so much about us? Actually, I found the attitude of the elders even more bizarre. It was as if they've known about you for a long time. You reckon? I didn't know it's nothing <laughs> weird. <laughs> just fucking a snot everywhere. But if it's bugging you, like, why don't you ask that old Chen Wasit bloke, eh? <laughs> Chen Wasit. You know, for once, I actually agree with you, Yangus. I seriously doubt he'll spit out the truth there and then, but it can't hurt to try. Yeah, let's go ask him. Maybe he'll tell. Oh, there's a treasure chest. Securely locked and cannot be opened. What? Even for my ultimate key? Madness. Simply madness. Anything in these cupboards? Ah, mini metal! Mini metal! Angel cheese. What on earth does angel cheese do? Blessed by an angel. Doesn't say. One would assume maybe healing? Maybe recovery? No, no, no. Mm, you look like there is something on your mind. Come on, out with it then. I see. You're curious to know why we seem to know so much about your Jaka. Well, that's hardly surprising, but I'm going to have to ask you to wait. For the moment, I'd like you to focus on the matter at hand. If that is, bringing the Lord of the Dragovians back to his senses and saving the Dragovian Sanctuary. When you have completed that task, I promise I'll answer each and every one of your questions. Fine. There's more cheese in here. Or more cheese. Yum, 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 yum. No more cheese. Uh, yeah, might as well. Uh. Awake already? How do you feel? Yeah, I slept well. To hear it. I'm counting on you. Today, so we've got to get up the heavenly dais first, days. though. The path is a labyrinth. The entrance lies beyond a portal, beneath the council chamber. Okay. Oh, that's upstairs. Why am I upstairs? Oh, because I was in my room. Okay. Let's go downstairs. Oh, the heavenly dais is a maze. <sighs> Can someone give me a map? I would like a map, please. Hmm. 
So do we just go or do we talk to them first? Will it just let us go? Beyond this door lies the path to the heavenly dais. I have been instructed to allow you to go through whenever you wish. You may pass. I'm sure the Lord of Dragovians will be waiting for you on the heavenly dais. Okie dokie. Now listen to me carefully. I cannot approach the Lord of the Dragovians in his present state, lest he drain my own strength away. Thus, I cannot accompany you to the dais, but I'll be fighting alongside you in spirit. I believe in you. I know you can bring the Lord of the Dragovians back to his senses. Damn, Skippy, we can. Now I might play the um the always flee from battle card. Oh, Munchie's back. Munchie, Munchie. Yeah. That doesn't make sense now. He should still have his uh, health sapped. You know. Uh, pfft. Uh, so I've got a guide. Uh, three pass in front of you, the middle one leading upward west is left. Uh, Uh, middle one? Hang on. <laughs> Let's uh, go with middle. Hey, let us flee. Why won't it let me flee? I'm wasting time. It's not going to let me flee, is it? One more. No. Fine. We'll fight. I can't waste so much time, like, trying to flee. Oh, God! Man, I think he's in... gonna be in trouble. It's a good hit. Jeez. What? How could he possibly keep making desperate attacks like that? That means I don't have him anymore. Does that mean Brickman, Goldman, and Thing are dead? Does that mean they're all dead? Oh, I've lost Brickman. Oh, that means I can't summon the golems anymore. I don't want that. Oh, for crying out loud. Well, this is a fine howdy doody. <laughs> First battle in the Dragovian area. I lose one of my stone golems. I'm going to make a quick detour back to Mori to have him put back to life again. 
Two. Monster Arena. Just gonna just fly straight back here. Morty! I have monsters down! <laughs> I was expecting that to go a little bit better. <sighs> you take casualties in the big bad bull day. My passion will help you. Thank you, Morty. You come see me, eh? Oh my god, so... It's like I feel I won't have too much trouble taking out the boss, it's just... Oh, all the bloody random enemies. Govian Sanctuary, back we go! Of course I wouldn't be doing that if you had to like run all the way back through the cave and stuff. I'm so sorry everybody watching. In my effort to do things quickly, I have failed you. Okay, if we lose any more monster team again, we're not going to bother bringing them back to life. That's too much of a faff. Let's just try and avoid combat. Because, like, you've got to get up the heavenly dais, and you've got to get there with health. I did try so very hard. Oh, I could have just loaded state again, couldn't I? I'm a fool. How can I... Flee! Thank you. Mini metal. Cool. Ah. Oh god, these guys took me out last time. Flee! Thank you. <laughs> this is the way, isn't it? Yes, it is. God, crystal stairs floating in the sky. <laughs> now the right one needs to lead that end. The southwest one will take you a test containing a midly medal. And the middle one will take you close to your goal. I want to get closer to my goal, please. Oh god. Oh, it's not going to let me flee again. Flee! Thank you. <laughs> I'm such a cheater. Now oh, there's a chest there. I can't not get it. It's practically on my route. 
It was actually a mimic. Oh, piece of awkward titanium. We like that. We can make stuff with that. That's useful. Super useful. Oh, there's another chest there as well. Oh, I think I might be able to take out a crocodog. I think my team might be able to take out a crocodog. Ah! Ah! God, these things are strong. Grinning maliciously. Damn, it took two of them. Use a desperate attack or something. Oh, you missed. Amazing. Poor form. Oh yes, yeah, Skull Helm. Oh wait, isn't that a thing? I can... Oh man. Uh... Oh, there's a thing I can make now. I think I can make... I've... I make the Skull Helm with something else to make a Sun Crown. I mix the Sun Crown with a beast hide and a tough guy tattoo. And I can make a second Timberell of Tension. Two Timberells of Tension. Imagine the possibilities. I almost want to go do that now. Well, we'll try this boss fight. And if we can't get it to work, we'll make a second Timberell and we'll come back. Flee! Yeah, I should probably heal. Just because anyone was hit. It's not going to heal me just before the fight anyway. Okay, here's the Lord of the Dragovians. Uh, looks a little bit intimidating. Now, usually these boss fights last a, quite a while. Um, so I'm probably going to end this part here and in the next part we will fight the Lord of Dragovians and hopefully find out about the hero's past and everything will be uh, fancy dory. So uh, thanks for watching, I'll see you in the next episode.